So I realize that I have a mistake right here. That is not the ordered pair 3, 8. That is the ordered pair uh, 8, 3. Now I'm ready to go ahead and set up my table. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and identify these points as well. I think that's going to help me out as well before I get going. And that point will be 0, 7. Okay, all of these points get tested in my constraint function. And my constraint function is, let's see, I want to maximize um, storage capacity. So that's the volume. So I'm going back and rereading. And in cabinet A, it holds 8 cubic feet of files. And cabinet B holds 12. All right, so I want to maximize capacity here. All right, of course, if I put in zero, I don't have any storage capacity, so that means I didn't buy any containers or any filing cabinets. If I put in seven, I'm going to have 12 times seven. That's going to be 84. If I put in eight and three, that's going to be 100. If I put in 12 times 0, I'll have 8 times 12, 96. So I can get the most amount of storage space if I buy 8 of cabinet A and 3 of cabinet B. And let's see. So how many of each type should you buy? There we go. 8 of A and 3 of B.